right, and uh, thanks for that uh, Kurt, and I probably will buy one of those, but right now you guys are looking at some gear of legendary Brian Killeray, coach of the Ottawa 67s, GM of the Ottawa 67s. Now you were inducted here in the Hall of Fame and you came to the big celebration last night. What does it mean to you to have finally a home for the Ottawa Sports Hall of Fame? I think it's great, and I think the city of Ottawa, you know, led by uh, our mayor, uh, Jim Watson, that it was just, this is just a perfect spot. You know, any any tourists coming in now, when they go through the Chatelory Parliament buildings and everything else, they'll come down here to see it. And the memories here, I mean, we have, we've honored uh, people from all around the country and a lot of memories for a lot of people. And so when they come down here, they're going to be amazed at the uh, tremendous uh, job that they've done. Do you think this will kind of help develop sports here in Ottawa? I really do. I mean, I think we have a great base. You know, there's so many volunteers that, uh, whether it be figure skating or uh, touch football or uh, uh, hockey, baseball, softball, whatever, I just think that uh, we've always produced uh, excellence mm -hmm. at every level. Now we're looking at many of the 243 inductees here. You have stories, I think, almost <laughs> at least half of the people in here, and you were sharing them with us today. Do you have some funny ones you can share with us? I know you were telling us one about uh, Gary Smith earlier. Oh, uh, Gary Smith, uh, his nickname was the Axe, and he was, uh, he was such a funny guy, but a great goaltender. And uh, one of the rules they put in the National League, uh, he always wanted to score a goal uh, the proper way. He wanted to stick handle, carry the puck and score a goal. And the National League put in a rule, you couldn't carry the puck past the blue line uh, if you were a goaltender, because he wanted to stick handle, knowing full well the perils that would come with it. And they made uh, the rule that you couldn't do it. And so that stopped one of his ideals. And then um, the other was, uh, he would be in the dressing room and at the end of the first period, I never forget this fellow just joining the club, and at the end of the first period, Gary Smith came in, took all his stuff off and walked in the shower and this guy turned to one of the <laughs> veterans and he says, uh, is he leaving? <laughs> and the guy says, no, that's what he does. And he came back after a quick shower and get all dressed again and go out and play the second period. It, it just, I guess it relieved him of any boredom. And you have stories about so many people, the funny ones, the oh. sad ones, the good memories. What's it like for you to look around the room and see all the fantastic athletes we do have here in the nation's capital over the years? I think it's tremendous, the, the number of excellent athletes we've produced and uh, Olympic athletes as well and um, champions. I just think it's, it's tremendous for us. Uh, as a city to have this kind of a, a showcase mm -hmm. and that's just what it is and you walk around here and you see so many many names that are honored names in the city and you are legendary in this community what is your advice to other people who hope to even have a quarter of the career that you've had what would you say to them well first off I'd say always work hard remember it's uh, the kids that we're coaching and above all when you're giving your message uh, to your team uh, the first first message would be make sure you have fun. I, I did that, I always had fun, and I like to see our team have fun. There's a time and a place to be serious. There's also always an awful lot of time to have fun. Fantastic, well thanks so much for joining us here today, and if you wanna come and check out Brian Kilray's gear, you can do so now because it's on display here at the Ottawa Sports Hall of Fame, and uh, they will be changing up the exhibits very frequently though, every couple of months, so you're gonna have to come down and check it out pretty soon, but stay with us, we have plenty more to come here from the brand new Ottawa Sports Hall of Fame. Liz Manley is coming up on the show, but right now we have to take a short commercial break.